Hi guys, my name is Megan, welcome to my channel. Today I have a huge Costco haul for you guys. My husband is actually going to be starting the GAPS diet today. We got all this stuff yesterday and so he's ready and has all the stuff that he needs to start this GAPS diet. It's actually a diet to heal your gut biome because so many health problems are caused from an unhealthy gut. I'm going to be doing it partially um, just because I'm pregnant. They don't recommend that you do it when you're pregnant, so I'll just I'll still be eating some other things to make sure I have extra carbs and stuff to keep me going. And a lot of the stuff he can't have until a few weeks into the diet, but we just wanted to make sure that we got it all now since our Costco is an hour away and we don't go very often. We buy things in bulk and we really don't go shopping very often at all. We only go to our local grocery store like every other week or something for bananas, but everything else we either have gotten in bulk from Costco or Azure, or I've canned myself from, from the crops that were available locally in the summer. So here's just a quick overview. You can see it is like mostly fruits and vegetables. <laughs> it's a lot. So let's get right into this. So I'll do the couple of frozen things first so I can get those back in the freezer. First is just some organic green peas. My daughter loves these as a snack. She's teething right now, so frozen things feel so good on her gums. And she loves peas, so this is like her go-to snack lately. <laughs> and they're organic. My husband can have these because you can have pretty much any vegetables as long as they're boiled or baked or as long as they're not fried. So we're gonna be using these in soup for him a lot. I also got some frozen blueberries. Again, my daughter loves these and they're really great for smoothies. Next up is asparagus, which I personally do not like asparagus at all, but it is one of the vegetables that my husband likes and he can have it when he's on this diet. So we got a package of asparagus, got a big bag of broccoli. My daughter loves this so much that she can eat this entire bag by herself in like a week or two. She loves broccoli. Two packages of celery. This is just a really easy thing to put in soup or something to, to make it a little different since there's not a huge amount of things that Luke can have on this diet. So it's just nice to have some different vegetables to add into soups to make them a little bit different. Mushrooms, mostly for me because I love having these in salads. They're my favorite. I got a big container of ginger root. I make my own elderberry syrup to keep us all from getting sick. So I use ginger root in that. We also love having ginger teas just for the health benefits. And this is one tea that my husband can have on the GAPS diet. So I got a bunch of it for us to enjoy a little tea in the evening. A big bag of spinach, apples. We got two packages of bananas, sun-dried figs. And so later on in this diet, dried fruits are okay for Luke to have as long as they're not, as long as they don't have sugar on them. And it is surprisingly hard to find dried fruit at Costco that doesn't have sugar on it. Like, fruit tastes just fine by itself. Why would you add sugar to it? So this was one of the things that didn't have sugar, and so this will be fun to try. We also got a box of raisins. This has two bags of raisins in it, and so this is just another dried fruit that didn't have sugar on it. Avocados. Avocados are one of my favorite vegetables ever. They're so expensive at our local grocery store, so I love getting a bag of avocados whenever we go to Costco because they're really good. And then we also got two two packs of this organic creamy peanut butter. This only has roasted peanuts and salt and so it's just really healthy, really simple. I know what's in it. So I got a big bag of baking soda. It's been a while since I've had to buy this because the bag is so huge but I'm actually running low on it. So decided to go ahead and get another bag while we're up there since we don't go to the store very often. I did get a bag of organic cane sugar. We don't eat very much sugar, but the main thing that I use this for is making our own kombucha. I haven't tried making it with honey yet, so I still do use organic sugar for that. Then I got two of these boxes of organic diced tomatoes. I got two boxes of organic tomato paste. I had been getting the tomato sauce of the same brand, but then I looked at the ingredients and there's sugar in it. So I switched to the tomato paste because this doesn't have sugar. <laughs> then I also got a bottle of organic extra virgin olive oil and I wanted to make sure that it was cold extracted because that's important. It's way healthier and it's really important especially for the GAPS diet. We got a bag of potatoes. 
This one was actually from another store called Smart Food Services because their potatoes are just a little cheaper and it was on our way anyway. So Luke can't have potatoes while he's on this diet because of all the starch in them, but they're just a really easy, simple thing for me to make for me and Sophia. So we will still eat some potatoes. And then we got three bags of these organic carrots. Three big bags of these. This is so much carrots. They're one of my husband's favorite vegetable and he can have them on this diet, so I'm sure he'll be going through a lot of them. A container of plain yogurt because normally I make my own yogurt in the Instant Pot, but I kind of ruined my last batch and I had used the last of my starter that I had saved from my previous batch, so I, need some more st I needed some more starter. So I'll use like half a cup of this to make the next batch of yogurt and then we'll just eat the rest of this. But Generally, I don't have to buy this because I just make my own and it just continues on because I use some from each batch to make the next batch and it just, it's a continuous cycle. But, yep, I burned it. <laughs> I let it get too hot and it got ruined and I, I'm just so forgetful while I'm pregnant. And then the last thing is way too big and heavy to show you on the screen, so I'll just insert a clip of it. But it is a 50 pound bag of onions. <laughs> This is so many onions. But again, my husband loves onions and he can have them while he's on the GAPS diet. So we are stocked up on onions for a long time. <laughs> it's crazy. So that is everything we got for this Costco haul. It's quite a lot and it's gonna last us a long time because we like to be stocked up and prepared. And I, I'm not one of those people who wants to go to the grocery store every week and get the food for that week. I really like being stocked up and having food for like three months at a time because I make every I make everything from scratch and it's just easier for me to buy in bulk. And if you guys are interested in seeing more videos on how the GAPS diet goes and more info about it, uh, just let me know and I will try to plan some videos like that. But I hope you enjoyed this Costco haul and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. <music>